The U.S. is scrambling to modernize the land-based leg of its nuclear triad. The 400 intercontinental ballistic missiles, known as Miniman 3, spread across the Midwest. The Air Force wants to replace the Miniman with a brand new missile in system called Sentinel, hopefully by 2030. But the Air Force is struggling with a rising budget that has ballooned from $60 billion in 2015 to more than $100 billion today. The latest cost increase triggered a breach that will now see the Pentagon step in to review the program to address the problems and proceed or terminate it. The Air Force says Sentinel is a vital national security program and that it must proceed. A crucial part of the program is overseen by the National Nuclear Security Agency, which is tasked with developing new plutonium shells for the Sentinel warhead. But the NNSA has not done this at a large scale since the Cold War, and the agency also faces several issues that will certainly put it behind schedule. Another problem for Sentinel, sending thousands of workers to states like Montana to work on the program. Some locals are upset over public safety and housing stemming from these new workers and say the Air Force has not addressed those concerns.